Let's take a look at this question. Which element below would have the most negative electron affinity value? Let's take a look at this uh, arrow diagram. Okay, the green one. It says uh, more negative electron affinity increases from left to right. So uh, we are talking about using a copy of periodic table and also increases, make sure it's the green one, increases from larger period to smaller ones. Okay, so that's the trend. Next, we just need to find out those different elements in the periodic table. Then we can apply this uh, arrow analysis, find out the answer. Now let's uh, find out those uh, elements in the periodic table. Magnesium. Next one's argon. Chlorine. Phosphorus. Sulfur. Now it is clear to us all of the five elements are in the third period. All right. So therefore, we can just use uh, this arrow analysis. The one on the right should have the most negative electron affinity. All right. Then you may say, okay, then the answer is argon. No, remember the noble gases, they are very stable. So uh, um, when we work on the uh, electron negativity or negative electron affinity, we don't even consider them. So uh, they have very, very low uh, uh, values on those, okay? So therefore the correct answer should be chlorine.